Hi YouTubers, this is part two of my um, loading coil I'm making. This is the original one sitting here with the angle adapter. And I've sort of copied it onto the new one. So what I've got is an SO239 socket there. The outer thread, outer thread goes to the counterpoise bracket and the inner goes to this end of the coil but on this one the inner goes to the crop lead for tapping down what the coil and I'm doing it the opposite way I'm having it so the coil will be connected to the SO2 all the time and the lead will be from here the top end and tap down the coil rather than tap up but before I make anything like this what I'll do is I'll um, connect this directly to that and put it on the the VNA and see what sort of response I get and I'm just going out into the garage and say I'm going to drill some holes in here to make sure that wooden block doesn't move if it shrinks with age and this one these wood screws go through the plastic into the wooden block and there's one there to stop the wooden block from moving. Okay with the uh, coil set up there four lengths of the telescopic section when I'm on 40 meters I'll just show you this 1.07 is the SWR and I'll connect the VNA and show you what that is in a graph. And as I say, that's with the full number of turns in circuit. This is the SWR and the 20 meter band. Here we can see it. 1.05. Okay, you may say. Well, how do you do a tap on there? Very simply, and it works really well. Put a wire, wrap it down round where you want it, on top of the other wire, like that, and twist it. When you get the right SWR settings you want for your application. You just twist it and then you can solve a lead on it and it makes a good electrical connection because it's following the route of the original wire. And that works a treat. Um, as it stands with the full length of the winding, this is ideal for the 40 meter band. For the 20 meter band, I've discovered you don't really need any taps you just short it out short the coil out completely and then you just slide the sections here to suit your SWR